Well, it just happens to be World Blood Donor Day, and in the wake of Sunday's mass shooting in Orlando, a large turnout is expected to give today. Now, among those donating, our very own Local 12's Adam Clements. Adam joins us now from the Hawksworth Blood Center downtown to tell us why this day is so important. Good morning, Adam. Good morning, John. You know, they still have my records on file at Hawksworth. The last time I donated blood was February of 2001. I was a senior at St. Xavier High School. We had a blood drive, and Dawn is about to let her rip here with me. Dawn, this process, you're looking for a vein right now. Right. You found a vein. We found a great vein. Okay, let her rip. Yep. Is this okay. going to hurt? Not at all. I'm not going to look. Great big stick in the skin. Instead, I'm going to talk to Alicia Lipton. <laughs> the Hawksworth Blood Center. Excellent. Thank you, Dawn. We are in. Uh, Alicia... World Blood Donor Day, it's extremely important, especially when you look at what happened in Orlando and all the people that were lining up to help. God forbid something like that were to happen here. You need all the blood you can get. We do, and we need people to donate actually before the crisis hits. All those people in Orlando had to come in on Sunday. They were lined up to donate, waiting in queue for hours. If people had come in earlier and that blood was on the shelf, it would have been ready to go to those patients at the hospital. So it is World Blood Donor Day, and we really need everybody to take that hour out of their day to come in and donate. If not today, you have the rest of the week. Now we do know that in Orlando right now they are fortunately all set on blood. So if you come out today, the blood that you donate is going to stay here local, uh, but that's just as important. What's the response been since Orlando? We have been getting several phone calls. Yesterday we had 20 phone calls from people who were not previous donors. So they'll be coming in to donate this week. Um, we do want everybody to know the blood that you donate, donate does stay here local. So it's going to help patients in 31 tri-state hospitals. And I am an O positive, but you're looking for any and all kinds of blood. Exactly. Just like the tragedy in Orlando, you never know what type of blood is going to be needed. So they were needing all types of blood. So we need to make sure that our shelves are full of every type. Every little bit helps. Uh, Dawn, Alicia, thank you so much. Uh, for now, we're going to send it back to you in the studio. We'll check in. Uh, make sure you make the switch over to Star 64 at 7 o'clock, uh, 7.30, and uh, we'll see how, this, how, how I'm feeling. I, I'm told I have apple juice and cookies waiting for me, so we'll send it back to you in the studio. Yeah, so I know that makes you happy, Adam, so <laughs> good for you, buddy. Um, for a complete list of Hawksworth locations and hours of operation, we have a link on local12.com. Just click on the Get It button. Nice.